What's going on guys? It's your boy 17 Gamer Dude here. Welcome back at it again with the year the annual the 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 update video that I do every single year. Yeah. The 2022 update video. This year I'm doing it different. I am sitting down. That's because of my injury. I mean I could stand up, but I choose not to because uh like, I, I, I want to move around and everything. I, and I think, and I can't really abuse that. But, welcome back. I'm genuinely excited for this update video. I've recorded every single other of my update videos. By the way, definitely check out because this kind of reacts with every single thing that I've announced on every single one of my channels. And uh, yeah, it's genuinely... I did record this update video last night, but I was just so tired. My mind was boggling with words and shit. And uh, I think I'm ready to kind of talk. I mentioned this in my preparing for 2022 video, but things are shifting for my life, honestly. And I'm gonna talk a lot on this video. So let's get straight into it. First things first, I wanna talk about a channel rename and rebrand. So what's gonna be happening is I'm definitely rebranding my stuff, which I'm gonna be talking about in a little bit with you guys. I do have ideas for the channel renames, but I'm gonna wait six months to see how this rebrand works to see if the rename is still potential to what's gonna be rebranded of my channel because what I really want to rename my channel to is Joel Gamer Dude. I think it'll be a pretty cool idea honestly because for my Joel vlog channel I'm gonna have it my actual name. For 17 plays I don't know how what I'm gonna name it yet but I think I might keep 17 plays to be honest because that's like my gaming channel you know. Speaking of rebrand though I'm gonna do something new with uh my vlog. I'm doing like a new type of like cinematic type of vlog. I got inspired to do this with Steezy Kane, but I think I'm adding like my own twist into it, honestly, which is gonna be pretty cool. There's gonna be moments where I add like content from my other channels on my videos on this channel, but it's gonna be like short clips so that like, if you guys really are invested into that one single part from that video, it's gonna be more of like a to be continued on that channel. So for example, like with my 17 plays, I have like this little skit that I really wanna do. And in the first 15 seconds, it's gonna show up in one of my videos here but it's gonna say to be continued in 17 plays so if people are intrigued by that little skit right there and want to see more of that skit they can go ahead and check out my 17 plays i think the only difficult part will be like uh the people clicking off on the video if i play my cards right probably people will like keep watching until the end and then they will be like oh wait there's this video that i wanted to check out i generally feel like i'll have like my own twist it'll show that like oh no one does these type of vlogs another thing that i really want to do in my uh vlogs also in my videos in general is 15 second plugs actually knowing me as a person that struggled so much to get to a thousand subscribers in literally nine years i really want to help out other people also like grow their channels honestly because i know it's difficult for them to reach an audience honestly i do have a couple of people in mind that i really want to do for those 15 second plugs i think i'm gonna actually get that certain creator to do a 15 second little ad on this channel on this video honestly I have like my own personal ads so that if you guys are intrigued with what you see like this goes with like thing with my other channels also you know they can go ahead and be like you know what I will check out his channel after I watch this video which you guys definitely should I really want to do that YouTube nowadays it's about like making community type of videos which which I am going to be talking about later on in this video next thing I really want to talk about actually is a schedule for my clip channel so if you guys don't know, I barely plugged this. Recently I have, but before I made my 17 Gamer to Clip channel back in like July, August is, and I've been uploading clips like literally every single day, honestly. So on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I uploaded three clips from this channel. On Tuesdays, I uploaded three clips from Joel TFD. On Thursdays, I upload three clips of Joel Vlog. On Sunday and Saturdays, I upload one clip of each uh, channel. So it's like three clips on those days. But on um, this year, actually, I'm focusing on uploading uh, four clips. So four for my 17 Gamer Dude channel on Monday and Friday, I'm gonna be uploading four clips. And then on Tuesdays, I'm gonna be uploading four clips for Joel TFD. And then on Thursdays, I'm gonna be uploading four clips of Joel Vlogs. And then on Wednesdays, I'm gonna be uploading two clips of like collabs that I've done with YouTubers, like with their videos. Saturdays and Sundays, what I do is I upload six clips. So I put two of Joel TFD, two of uh, uh, Joel Vlogs, two of this channel. I really do want you guys to go subscribe to my clip channel, by the way. That's like the type of channel that you'd see before you go to work or it's like you don't have time to watch like a 10 minute video you can like watch a little bit of clips and be like oh you know i'll watch this clip and this clip and that clip so another thing i really want to talk about with you guys which is 
Look at mind boggling. This year is gonna be the 10 year anniversary for my channel. It's four crazy yo crazy the fact that it's been literally 10 years almost 10 years that this channel was born and it's crazy it's generally crazy it's gonna be difficult to kind of release uh what i want to release on my 10 year anniversary but i'm definitely gonna try my best and i think this is the point now where i get into my whole like background story of uh things because that's what the rest of this is gonna go from and the reason why i say it's gonna be difficult for me to kind of release what i want to release on the 10 year anniversary is because i'm gonna be distant from making content in general you know just because i think all my life i've been prior to prioritizing youtube instead of what i really need to focus on like work on uh, my health uh, my wealth honestly and i think this uh, is definitely taking a toll on me honestly personally like with this injury it it and it has got me thinking i kind of wrote this down because it was hard for me to explain last night because i went on like a whole five minute rant don't get me wrong i'm very grateful and appreciative of getting a thousand subscribers without giving up honestly i know there's a couple of people that like wanted to do youtube but it was so hard for them to get to this point of on thousand subscribers and the fact that i did it without giving up i'm super proud of myself and i'm super appreciative of all the support that you guys have given me and everything but the fact that it's it took me this long to get a thousand subscribers it doesn't look good the mistake that i've made honestly was that 2019 i explained this in my drop on um, why i dropped out of college video but on 2019 i actually got to that point in school where they told me to just take a semester break but then i decided myself that i'm not even gonna go back to school i like quote unquote dropped out you know on 2023 i do decide to go back to college and it's something that i had to think really deep about to be honest i think i was just playing a, like a dangerous game when i dropped out of college and i had nothing to rely on and i really kind of put my my all into youtube you know without knowing how it would affect me with my health my wealth and just kind of everything in general in life because especially with work you know because i never worked i only worked like twice every single week back in like 2020 and then like i, I would say i at, by the end of 2020 i started like getting my shit together with like working a little bit more but i'm gonna like admit it actually took me since like last literally last year probably like in august or in july where i actually started putting in more hours into work honestly and it, it's like it's something that i definitely like want to like focus on this year you know because i have like personal goals also like i want to buy my first card this year to be honest that's something that i really want to do i also want to buy like a pokemon booster box for the first time actually for my jewel the collector 12 video because i think that video will probably go will be so amazing to be honest to see me get like a booster box and split it it's, it's got i generally want to get that and i have like other things i want to get too like at least like stuff that i can improve with my room you know something that i can like reward myself if i do something good you know not only that but i really want to go back to the gym also like a public gym honestly because working out at home is good don't get me wrong but the fact that i've lost motivation when after those like three months that i did so well back in 2020 it's hard to like get back into that momentum because i tried i really did try to get back into that momentum but it was just so difficult because like of how packed i was with work and everything and i was just so disorganized to be honest and i think this year i really want to be more organized with prioritizing work my health and everything and just kind of prioritizing on that first then in youtube that's why i say i really want to be distant from making like being straight up with youtube honestly like not relying on youtube i'm not gonna lie it's definitely gonna be difficult for me to kind of lay off of youtube honestly but i mean don't get me wrong like i said i'm still gonna be making content for you guys you know like i'm not i'm not saying that i'm gonna stop you know and just focus on other things i'm just saying that like i want to prioritize other things in my life first you know like if once i get that shit settled then i'll 100 percent definitely be more trying my best to be a a little bit more consistent on this but right now especially with where i'm at in my position in life right now i really want to focus on that and i also have like, other goals for my channels too like for joel tfd i explained this there but i really want to film my like first short film and i also have like community type of videos that i really want to do for this channel which i think will be a lot time consuming to be honest and that's like the best part of what this year has come to be honest me being organized you know i i really want to like put in the work now i don't want to only talk about it i really do when i put in the work because i always end up just talking about stuff that's the update video i'm so happy that i got that out because yesterday i was struggling so much talking about it to be honest but who man i'm generally excited honestly for this year i hope you guys are too uh man this is gonna be cool this is gonna be a cool year honestly you know oh 
Okay, yeah, I remember now. So, seeing that, but let's talk about that before I get to the goals. So, no, no, it was there. It was there. It was there. Damn it. It was there. Oh, okay. The only two channels that I will be consistent on a little bit will be my Joel Vlogs channel and also my Joel the Collector 12 channel. So make sure you subscribe to those channels if you really want to see more content from me, like genuinely more content. So for goals that I really want to do for this year, honestly, for this channel, I don't want to reach 10,000 subscribers, but I think generally we should reach 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year. I know it's going to be probably hard. You know what? I would say 1.5K. Let's get to one. 5k if i'm gonna low ball it 1.5k but i do want to reach 10,000 subscribers so if you guys can help me get to 10,000 subscribers that'd be pretty cool for my like internet socials like twitter instagram and tiktok currently right now for instagram i'm at 752 but i do want to get to a thousand followers on instagram so if you guys can help me get to a thousand followers on instagram that would be cool so make sure you follow my instagram if I even put it there, it's going to be weird if I don't. On my Twitter account, I'm at 335 followers, but I don't want to reach 450 followers. So make sure you follow my Twitter account. If it's right there, it would be kind of weird if it isn't. And then also for my TikTok, I, I'm at 168 followers, but I want to get to 350. So who? That's definitely going to be weird if it's not there. But yeah, that's going to be the end of this update video. I am so am. Let's... Get it, boys. I'm so excited. Oh, peace out, guys. Remember, guys, to check out my other update videos. And uh, this is my final update video that I'm doing today because it is 1 o'clock p.m. at the moment. And I got to edit all of these videos before 2.30. And I only did my Joel to Collector 12 one. So, um, uh, upload wise. But, yeah. Uh, <laughs> if you guys did enjoy the video, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Peace out, guys. Remember, guys, to enjoy your day. Make everything awesome today. Everyone. Stay positive, be positive. You guys already know to have a positive mindset. Don't forget the remake. And and negative mindset. And also carriages. And also a new single that I'll be releasing this year.